stools. Uh. But it's very hard though. Mm. What has you been eating? Uh, we, we normally buy this um, Expo brand. Uh, we used to give him Reptomin until it went out of stock. Mm. So we changed to that brand. But then we recently changed, we today just changed back to Reptomin, which he is eating normally. Okay, so, so when did the stools come? The, this hard? Uh, give me a second, let me check. Uh. Yeah, just wait for it to come. Okay. Not long, I think less than one, one week. Is it after the change of Rectomin? Uh, or before the one change? Kg. Before the. One kg is After exactly. the change. Mm. After the change, yeah. Mm. But, but he used to eat that food as well last time, and then there wasn't any issue, so we were, we were not sure what happened. Eat other things like like uh, worms, uh, no other things. But we left him outside sand. our house. There's a sand there. No, there's no. Garden. No, if we don't, we don't keep it in the garden. We kept it in the rabbit cage. Okay, what's inside there? Anything? No, no it's just food? water with with the. Any rabbit food? No, it's it's all. He has been living in there for a while. Does he has access to water? Did he still go swimming? No, I mean he stays in that tank, but we but we let him out on to walk and he doesn't eat. Is it this this the? Uh, yeah, see, see, uh, see the video. Yeah, twenty second November. Twenty second November, which mm. is not long now. Uh. Very smelly one here. Does he eat a lot of grass or anything or uh, Because this is more fiber. You know? No leh, he. We, I don't. They're very smelly uh. When we bring him out, I don't notice him eating anything. But he has access to water or not? Yes, he has access to water because we kept two together and the other one is fine. Oh. Mm. Did they stay together? Uh we separated them yesterday because we noticed that there was something wrong with him. These are the male or female? Uh the that time I brought him to another vet, the vet said that it's a male, but she said that she cannot confirm as well. Very very easy actually. Now, in, in the male, uh, first of all, the claws are very long. Very long. Uh, longer mm. than these are uh, the front claws. Oh, so this is three a female. Longer, uh. Then uh, the second one is, in the, in the male, uh, this, this part uh, mm. is concave, uh, when you see it. Oh. Because you can climb over the female, mm. uh, so it's concave. But this one is flat, uh, almost flat, you can see there. Uh, almost flat. Uh. Mm. So this is a male, female. A female, female. Uh, then the third way to tell is, the vent. Uh. In the female, the vent had the opening. Uh. That is the vent had uh, the opening. Uh. Oh. oh, okay. It's uh, supposed to be nearer, uh, nearer to the base. Uh. Oh. But this one's a bit, but a bit far. But anyway, these two, these two will be the main thing. Uh. Mm. The lowest shell we call it the. It, it shouldn't be flat. Uh. It, should be, it is flat in the female. And the claws are longer in male. Uh. It, this female is short. In female is bigger size and then the head is bigger. Um, of course you can't compare because it, how old is it? Uh, we have him for have her for around 14 years. 14 years. Did she lay any eggs? Mm, I mean the eggs should be white colour, right? Yeah, did she lay anything? We don't see anything uh, so far. This is the only thing that we spotted that was a bit abnormal. That's why we brought her to for a checkup. Okay, so so this this uh red ear slider mm. uh, has has she ever been uh, fat protein food or very high protein food uh? meat uh, uh, prawns la, fish no la. we don't feed so you just feed uh, pellets on it pellets yes and there's no sunlight right uh in the past my previous house we don't have sunlight so maybe that's why it's like uh, that but shell, yeah, but currently cool. the new house it has there, there is a lot of sunlight because we actually place um them under the sun. Mm. So, but but I noticed that she doesn't like to bask. Yeah, they're not used to it. Yeah. They, they avoid the sunlight. It's too hot, is it? What, what, what time what time you put it under the sun? We Because we don't have space in the house, we actually leave it out in the patio. So... 24 hours? I mean the whole day under the sun? Uh, because the sun shifts, so it won't be there mm. the whole time. Right. Mm. Now this one is thin, as you can see. Uh, there's practically no fat, is it? The whole thing is shrunken. Uh. Oh, we thought very that he's quite fat. Eh? Very thin, uh, thin. Uh. This terrapin is thin. Uh. So, uh, we're not feeling enough. Uh. 
Yeah. What do you feed? Just pellets only. Just pellets. How many pellets does he does does she eat per day? Per day around ten. Ten is too little. Because we, we they said that we are supposed to feed uh only one uh two uh once every two days so we don't have to feed too much. No. Oh, we're not supposed to, we're supposed to feed more. Yeah, ten only ten pellets. Yeah, morning and night we feed around total twenty. Maybe around fifteen ish for the whole day. No, too little. So how much are we supposed to be feeding? You should feed as as long as the the terrapin eats the. Oh. And then you can see that the, this part will be quite fleshy, of course. Uh, it won't be less easy until like no. Because the head can't go in, mm-hmm. so we thought that is she's too fat, so we, we we thought that we shouldn't be feeding so much. The head can go in, but not much, uh, there. Yeah, that's why. Right. Then the hands can't go in, so we thought that. No she's hands too always fat. can't go in. Yeah. And also the cause the the shell is huh? on the mm-hmm. top yeah. side. Oh. Should be covering it, it should be straightforward. Mm. Yeah. That's because not enough sign right in the previous no, place. Either the nutrition was no good. Nah. The shell doesn't form nicely. Mm. You see that? The rings doesn't grow well. Mm. But so this one you, you can give a variety of food. Nah. Like? Uh but but now you just give only the pellets. Yeah, because she doesn't like vegetables. Mm. How about uh shrimps? Shrimps are uh, pieces of shrimps. Pieces of shrimps are uh, because my my parents are not quite for shrimps uh, right. uh, because they they heard that it actually makes the the, the animal very aggressive. Mm. Is there? Because it's so skinny, you can even see the hollow. Like, it's the hollow. It shouldn't be a hollow. It should be quite a fleshy thing here. Oh. It's very thin. Uh, I'm surprised it's still alive. Uh. Also, maybe that upsets the whole intestinal system. So. This one you didn't notice? No, because we, we thought that huh? we thought that it's supposed to look like that. No, no, no. They are really fleshy. Yeah. This is really like no more flesh, uh, no more fat. Uh, that's it. When it was sunken. Even the neck. So, so it's just it's just surviving on the bare minimum. Uh, huh? Bare minimum. Uh, so. So other than the pellets, what what else should we be? Uh, normally, I would advise a mixture. Uh, a mixture of uh, shrimps, fish, pieces of fish, small small one. Uh, I was that depends on whether she likes it or not. You've got to slowly get her used to it, and then uh, of course uh, veggies. Those some some they like, you know, but it, I think you've got to chop to small pieces first. Okay. It, and then uh, the other thing is the uh, vitamins. Uh, huh? Yeah, it, it is definitely too thin. Uh. So I'm surprised that there's too how much too she passes a day. Just this, this one only? This is a bit abnormal. Normally, it's, it's very like... Thin, very thin one. Uh. Long one, actually. Gluey one, yeah. Gluey. It's like glue like that, uh, come up. It's mm. quite longish. Mm. So this is probably due to accumulation of the stools uh, until finally all come out in one shot. Oh. This, this terrapin has water to drink or not? Uh? Yes. Definitely, yeah. Yes, yes, because we, we normally keep in this kind of water. 24 hours? 24 hours, yes. Well, it, it shouldn't be 24 hours on water, you know. It should be probably uh, 12 hours and then the other 12 hours, for, I mean for this sick one. Uh, unless there's a place where you can climb up, the tilted or where they, they can come up. Does she, does she have this? He just have this tank only. Uh, for, it, it used to be a bigger tank for, for her and another one. Mm. So, they were so fighting, we, they were fighting we, each other. This one beat the other oh, right. tail off, so right. there's no space for Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, we wanted a basking corner, but she beat off the other tail, so we don't have right, to put them right. together. So th- there's fighting because of that. So yeah. so I- if you, 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 you have a tank, then it should be a slope so that they, they can climb up with it, oh, to dry okay. themselves, but it, it, they don't have right. Oh. But I give them one person one rock each. Uh. This one is too small, too so small. you can't even climb up. I mean, how, how are they going to climb up? I mean, normally they want to, even if they want to dry themselves, they also cannot. No. Anyway, this, this one looks like very weak to, to to be able to, to climb up anything. Can she climb? Uh, not much. So what you do is uh, give them maybe a few hours, maybe three to four hours of dry. No? Three to four hours of dry, okay. Uh, not, not 24 hours of water, right? You're, you're putting 24 hours of water. Okay, right? can I, I, will, I will change the tank. No, I mean, you don't have time for them. Do you have time? Uh, for the exercise? Exercise, we bring them out to walk uh, uh, each time. Where? Uh, out in my bed.